Hey, welcome to another week here to Solo in. So we are working again on some pro smallest projects on the inside, just trying to get things finished before the windows come and we can work on the outside. Um, we want to do some chases. Um, those are wooden boxes around um, pipes that are protruding from the walls and the ceilings and we obviously need to cover them up so that we can drywall over them. Um, and the second project that we need to do is getting the pipes. Um, has to do a lot with plumbing this week, obviously not the plumbing itself, but uh, covering that up. Um, we want to finish the uh, pipes where they go into the, the vent stacks, where they go into the roof. So we need to uh, make that all airtight too. So our first project this week is to get these vent stacks and the vent cover that we have on the roof here airtight so that the air and the gases from the pipes will just leave the house um, through the vent stack and not come back inside. So what we're going to do is some foam panels right around this and then I'm gonna spray it around it so that um, in the future when we spray from the entire roof line, it is already um, ready for it. We can spray from around, uh, right on top of it. Another project that we would like to cover this week is putting a chase, so a wooden box around all the pipes here, so that this is all covered and we can finish it with drywall later on.
So I'm pretty happy with how this turned out. It's covering all the pipes and it is pretty strong, um, especially since we're only going to hang some half winch drywall on top of that just to cover it up. And then obviously finish it up with maybe some crown molding and um, just make it a little bit less conspicuous. And then we still have to do the section in the bathroom where this continues. So unfortunately I need to get a few pieces um, of wood for that because I need longer pieces to get from the floor to, uh, floor to the ceiling all the way. And then I also want to do the bathroom um, or the kids bathroom over there. So we finished the chase over in the kids uh, bathroom, now we have to do one over here. This side is a little bit uh, harder because we don't just have to put a chase or we don't have just have to put framing on one side and the, on the other side of the pipe and just be done with it. We actually have to go and put a, a horizontal chase that comes over this way and then a vertical one this way. And since the pipe is in the way and I, don't want, I want to make them uh, the least intrusive as possible. I am going to just put some framing that is an L wall here that basically just goes on the bottom of this and comes down vertically along the pipe on this side and then on the outside I'm going to just put some additional framing members so it's easy for us to finish it but I'm going to keep it very simple and as least uh, members as possible just to close it all up. So I'm pretty happy we got in the kids bathroom this chase here finished. Another one over here in the guest bedroom and the continuation over into the guest bathroom where the pipe is covered up all the way. Well it's pretty late on Sunday evening and I think I need to get going. So this is it for this week. Have a wonderful um, week and I will see you guys next time I'm going to turn on the camera. Bye!